it's getting a lot more expensive to cut the cord and stream your favorite shows. Yeah, Amazon becoming the latest to jump on the bandwagon and tell its users that they have to pay extra if they want to keep their Prime Video experience ad-free. Fox Eye Stephanie Bertini takes a look at the plan and how, at the end of the day, you could be paying more. If you want to keep watching Amazon Prime commercial free, it will cost you $2.99 more as of January 29th next year. I don't want to be charged. <laughs> I don't like it. <laughs> I don't like commercials, so $2.99. What is it? $2.99 feels like a lot, but... Whether consumers mind or not, the changes are part of an industry trend. Major streaming services like Hulu, Netflix, and Max are charging more for ad-free subscriptions now. Streaming media analyst Dan Rayburn says it comes down to money. Because the cost to produce and license content is just so high. All of this may seem very familiar. I think what we're seeing right now in the streaming service is very similar to cable. I, I like to describe streaming as a new pay TV bundle. And it can all get pricey. A tip for consumers from experts, decide what content you want to stream and double check you're not paying for it twice or even more than that between all the streaming services and cable if you still have it. In a notice to its customers, the Amazon Prime team said, this will allow us to continue investing in compelling content and keep increasing that investment over a long period of time. We aim to have meaningfully fewer ads than linear TV and other streaming TV providers. When it comes down to advertisements, experts say data proves many of us aren't willing to pay not to see them. Consumers love low price and they're not willing uh, to pay more in most cases. So watching some commercials in exchange for a lower price, it's not something consumers have a problem with. Stephanie Bertini, Fox 5 News.